Alright guys, welcome back for Custom Robo, part 13 for the GameCube. And my controller's not even working on me, wow. Alright, so we're done. We can get out of... Oh, come on, controller, work with me here. Controller, thank you. Oh, whoa, whoa, no, no, not that. Alright. Okay, so I was apparently here. Sorry guys, it took a small break in between. So I think we're supposed to be going to our job, right? Steel Hearts. Oh hey, Marcy's back. And Mike Cholo, oh, there we go. Uh, just the parts, just in case. All right, no, no, no. What's going on over here? Hey! Hey, Marcia. You're here. So, what happened yesterday? Uh huh. She's, she's been acting like she's been like this all day. I try to talk to her, and she just climbs up, all claim like. We're supposed to be partners, but she's not acting real partnerly, you know? I can't figure her out. Harry, give her some space. She'll talk about it if she wants to. But you can't force her. Yes. Oh, hey, it's Ernest with this awesome chair. Whee. I see you're all here. Good. Now listen up. Lately, we've had a real bad run of luck. You all seem overworked and just a little stressed. Marcia, I'm looking at you. Anyway. Surprise! I've entered you all into today's battle tournament. You did what? Come on, Chief. You know how tired we are, so why not just give us the stinking day off? Hey, I paid your entry fees. You should show a little appreciation. And you better win, you hear? If you if you do, it'll be great publicity. Oh, let me try that again. If you do, it'll be great publicity for our office. As I adjust the camera and it slightly moves to the right. Camera. All right, here we go. So that's what this is about. You couldn't care less how we tire how tired we are. He's not worried about us at all. Isn't that right, Marcia? Uh it must oh, she's still worrying about the ellipses, man. Hey, Marcia! Oh, the tournament um, sounds like fun. <laughs> oh, not you too. Why did I even bother getting out of bed this afternoon? Alright. Alright, team. You've got your assignment. The tournament is at the training gym. Do whatever it takes to win. Remember, it's for the good of the office. For Steel Hearts! Alright guys, let's move out. Go to that tournament. Why am I walking so slowly? Even I should know I should kick up the pace. Oh, uh, this is a lot of control, huh? Oh boy. Doing... wait, oh okay. Doing Ernest's voice is slightly tiring. But still kinda fun. There still aren't too many people here. We got a little time before things get started. I'm gonna go look around. You guys better win your matches. Here's how we will do it. I'll win first, place, Marcia can have second, and Miguel, you take third. Why is that? You don't <laughs> Why don't we each try our best and see what happens, right Marcia? Marcia, are you listening? Right, see you at the finish line, or Holoceum, or whatever. Miguel, chat up some, some, oh, dang it. Miguel, chat up some of the competition. Oh, uh, sorry. I, can we, can you read that? Okay. I'll be the winner. Mar uh, 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 what, you got a problem with that plan? I kind of do. No. Oh. You probably know as a customer was made me cute. Well, yeah. 30 centimeters tall? Obviously the higher bar is the more damage the bomb does. SPD? Speed. The higher the bar, the faster the bomb moves towards the target. Useful ones are a little too useful, don't you think? Uh-huh. Uh, not here yet. Oh, wow. Uh, bomb graph. This reverses the bomb blast radius. Okay, so that's kind of helpful, I guess. The higher the bar, the bigger the bomb. The blast radius. TIM is at the time that reflects the blast effect. The arena. Oh, okay. Same deal here. The higher the bar, the longer the blast sticks around. Down is the part of the like, knockdown power. It's kind of cool. The higher the bar, the more knockdown force. You know what I mean? Anyway, I shouldn't say too much since we're both competing, so I think I'll shut up now. Wow. Oh, look at this guy looking out the window. I have to win five consecutive matches to take the championship. It's tough. I might be young, but I've put in a lot of hours on the training machines here. Let me show you off what is someone there. Do you know? Power graph, customers, robot, string, HM, engine, homing. 
Uh huh. Size of the blast, yeah. Oh, detonates again. The high bar, okay. Am I a genius or what? Well, I guess, but you're telling your opponent pretty much what you're doing. This is just the first step on my road to becoming a great commander. I'm gonna win today. Too bad my father can be. Oh, well, that sucks. Uh, I'll make him proud of you if he's not. Oh, okay. Tell me something about Robo. Oh yeah, <laughs> let me tell you a little bit something about the robot. Wow. Aren't I stingy? It's like, dude, I don't want to hear your sob story. Just let me know what's going on in the sky, uh, on the actual robots. So, robots area abilities, that's how we'll move in the air. Same deal here, the higher the bar, the, uh huh. Attacks, that's your attack. And the da 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 That's all I can tell you, that's the other from right row. Ah, oh, it's the sax guy. Looks like there's 32 competitors? Holy! Uh, I'll explain because... <laughs> Let me just get down to the chase guy. I'll tell you about robo stuff. This is all kind of basic. That's something you can, I don't know, figure out. Uh, I don't know, on the way. Let's talk to Marcia, maybe. Oh, let's talk to Mar Oh, wait, my controller just messed up. My bad. Uh, Marcia, hello. That's all I was able to determine. I'll have to focus really hard. Uh, these people. Chat. The pot. More graph stuff. Uh huh. Uh huh. That's all I gotta say. I don't want to play with the robots by itself, but I learned about working. Wow, well, so, okay. I'll be the winner. Marcy will be. Uh, you just say the same thing over again, Harry. And these people will not. So, when does this thing actually start? Do I have to talk to everybody or what? There's no new part. Oh, we wanted to avoid the line, so we got here early. Now we all, now we all just want to go home. The kids are bored. My wife is bored, and heck, I'm bored too. Maybe taking, oh, or talking to you will make me less bored. Oh my goodness! Enough of the graph, please. I get what you're trying to say. So I'm pretty much just, I pretty much have to just talk to everybody. Let's just talk to the kids. You guys are just impatient. I'm not gonna be able to. For someone. Huh! Wow, thanks. Not rooting for me. Uh, I know this already. Rapid fire? <sighs> Man, someone's outside. The leaf blower, you jerks. Oh, so we're starting the tournament now. Oh, Marcy is up to bat first. This girl's mind is obviously not on the battle, but she's still putting up a good fight. I hope you win, Marcia. You better win. I won, I won. I don't know if I should be too proud, though. My opponent never showed up. Wow! What, what do you want? Are you my first opponent? I already lost. That was quick. Hey, it's you. Are you my first opponent? When... Your battle table is here. Oh, so I'm facing the kid first. Good luck, Harry's waiting for you at the table. Battle table, okay. I'm not the one you're supposed to fight. In fact, I just finished my match in a matter of seconds. My father and I have a dream for me to become a great commander. I have to win. Okay, good for you. Isn't that the kid that lives next door to you? Don't expect me to you. Uh-huh. That kid's got guts. Try not to let him beat you, Miguel. Uh... Oh, my <laughs> lord. All right, more tutorial. When you charge by using the X button, your robo is invincible while it's lit up. If you time your charge right, you can approach your opponent while dodging his attacks. Watch out though, you'll be vulnerable to attacks right before and after you charge. Got it? Got you, Harry. Okay, don't underestimate him just because he's a kid. I don't think I was going to anyway. Okay, what kind of robo is this kid? Oh, hey, he has that opening robo from the opening, the robo, yeah. Slide that up so you guys can at least kind of see it. But I'm gonna have to speed and truck a little this along, and my robo's ready to fight, right? Yup, yup, yup. So let's start the battle. We don't know what kind of Holocene we're in, so. What the? It's a very kitty looking Holocene. Man, I got it. What? Alright, bring it on, kid. Train moves. 
Oh boy. Oh. Can the train hurt you? It'd be kind of interesting if you ow. I can. Ugh. This kid's getting on my nerves. Get down so I can mess you up. Oh, dude! And the train doesn't hurt you. How am I losing to such a scrawny punk? Come on, my pod satellite thingies, get out! He's using the freaking three-way. I won't lose! I'm going down. Ow. Ow. No! I should just stop backing fancy, just... Oh, no! Oh, God, this battle's getting intense. down yes we got him guys holy moly that was crazy that would have killed me right there I can't believe this little punk got me down to that much low health Whew. I now have access to the twin flank pod G go visit the parts is it could it could it, could it save please uh, oh hey kid don't feel too bad you did good you put up a good fight uh-huh <laughs> huh Oh, yeah, um, I'm sure you would have done better in your dreams. Does it save? Oh, it doesn't even save! And Marcia looks pretty sad, so let's, let's go see what she's going on here. Marcia? Marcia! Oh, we got Larry and I have won the second match. Good luck. Man. <laughs> oh, not her! Hmm, I can't. I'll end up taking it easy on here. I won my first match by default, but this guy looks strong. I'm so unlucky. Oh, don't worry about it. I'm pretty sure you'll. Oh, hey! Taidon guy! When you first buy a custom robot, it only comes with a standard set of parts. The more battle experience your robot has, the more parts you can use. See, whenever your robot has a battle, the data is stored on its internal processor, and then the parts generator registers any new parts your robot has developed the ability to use. Anyway, that's a bunch of technical nonsense. Just be sure to check the generator often. So we got the twin flank pod G. Ooh, another twin. Uh, uh, another twin flank. Remember, we're using the twin uh, flank thingy H some whatever. I'm pretty empty in here. It's pretty empty in here, considering how many entrants there are in today's tournament. Lots of. What, what's that last thing you say? Lots of people leave as soon as they lose, others just wait outside until it's their turn. No, I see. Can't believe I missed my match. I shouldn't have tried to take a. Oh, that sucks. Maybe they'll give the loser a second chance. Yeah, right. So that's how that girl won by default. Shouldn't have taken that. What a strange coincidence. Who could have thought you'd be the boss versus spying my husband to the children to get some juice? Okay. Uh. Here he is when you Okay. You better. Oh, uh, your battle table's here. Your opponent's waiting. Battles and cooking need lots of preparation. When you're ready to go to the other side of the Holocene deck and the bear save button. Okay. So let's check what that uh, thingy does. Okay, it deploys one pod left and one pod right, deploys two pods to the blood. And I'm sure you use it when a wall is separate. Okay, what's the difference though? Does it do more damage? No, it does almost exactly the same exact thing. What's the difference? I don't know. So, in the next part, we'll start up uh, the rest of the tournament, and maybe I could save somewhere so I could put this off for a little bit, because I'm kind of getting tired, guys. No jo uh, no joke. But I'm still interested to play. But, ugh, the massive upload of parts yesterday was a lot for me. But stay tuned, guys, for more episodes. Or, when I say episodes, I mean more parts coming soon. So, I'll see you guys then.